I'm going to show you how to make a makeup brush holder using this candle votive that I got at the Dollar Tree. I love how it kind of flowers up a little bit. Um, the first thing I do, I always like to wear old clothes, something that you don't mind um, getting dirty in, and always wash the cup with um, dish liquid first just to get all the residue or if you had any labels or anything on the bottom and I'm going to be using polyacrylic by Minwax. I'm going to use uh, this foamy brush and I like to use extra fine glitter in the color of your choice. I'm using this one today just because it's such a pretty color to stand out for um, this tutorial. And then I always keep like a paper towel handy. So I have another paper plate over here that has the polyacrylic on it. And I'm just going to dip this in here. Um, and I'm going to coat the glass. Trying not to get too much at the bottom because then the, uh, this is what the glitter is going to stick to. And then I try to do this quickly. And this kind of dries quickly as well. Um, and today in Kentucky, we are having an unusually warm February day. So the windows are open and it is warm in the house. So I just like to get the inside coated really good. And if any of it settles at the bottom, that's why I love these spongy brushes. You can just kind of soak it up at the bottom. And anything that's in there, we can dump back out into the container. I wouldn't worry about the air bubbles. Those are not going to show. Okay, now that I have this coated, I'm going to take my glitter and I'm going to kind of pour it into the glass. And I am going to kind of shake it around and I'm going to tilt. Okay. Looks like it needs just a little bit more. Right here. And again, just tilt. Now, that is how simple and easy it is to do. Um, I am probably going to go back over it with a second coat of polyacrylic. Also, if you have a vinyl cutter, which I do, you can cut out a cute little uh, decal and put on it um, however you would like to do that. So stay tuned.